Hey y'all, it's the Costume Jeweler. We're going into the Salvation Army to look for purses, jewelry, knickknacks, doodads, and trinkets to resell on YouTube and eBay. So hit that subscription bell, hit that notification bell, and click all so you don't miss out on live buy it nows and auctions on my channel. And hit a thumbs up for this video, and let's go see if we can find anything to peck up to resell. Walking right into the purses. At least the purses that are laying here on the counter. Duckhead? Never heard of Duckhead purse before. Have y'all? That's different. So know nothing about that one, but we're gonna check it out. Duck head. Hmm. If y'all know anything about that that brand of purse, let me know. But here it is. Let's see if it's leather. I've seen that brand, but I think it seems like I've seen it. I don't know where I've seen it. Seems like maybe it's sporting stores. It's made of vinyl. We'll pass. We will pass on it. I know, that's horrible. Genuine leather. Not branded patchwork. Always looking for that treasure. Now, I did find a uh, coach backpack in here, brand new condition, without tags. I haven't sold it yet. I've not even listed it yet. Can you believe that? So, they, they'll have purses hanging here, and then they'll have purses on the wall. I like leather that looks like this. Oh, wow, this is an old Patricia Nash look. An old Patricia Nash. Right when I always think I'm not going to find something, I find something. Look at that. So, very nice find. I'll take a Patricia Nash, new or old. How about y'all? Joy, Nine West, Cork, Studded, Under One Sky, never heard of that, ooh, a fancy guess with the tags still on it, look at this. Fancy guest bag. Is it fancy? Is it leather? It's got some rubs though, so we're gonna pass on it. I don't know if those rubs will come off patent leather or not, but we are gonna pass on it. Still a good looking purse. And looky here. Look how fancy this is. Look how super fancy. And it's great condition. Look at this. There you go, my cousin Rosetti. Not a bad looking Rosetti there. Is this, who's this? Harvey Bernard. I've had Harvey Bernard before. Kohan, look at that Kohan crossbody. Now that's cute. It's kind of a different vintage looking Kohan. I like the way it looks in the front. I like it, let's see. Brass hardware. 
It's a crossbody. I think we're going to get it. So you'll see it for sale at some point, but it looks vintage. So we're going to get that. So we've got the Patricia Nash so far and that one right there. So I'm shopping. I'm looking for also Christmas stuff to take the farm. What is this one? Mark by Mark Jacobs. Now this is a good looking bag. I like it. Never bought a Mark by Mark Jacobs bag. Is this old or not? It's not new. I sometimes gravitate, which y'all know, towards the biker bat looking bags. But I don't know if we'll get this one or not. It does have the strap still in it. Here's the hang tag. Don't know if we'll get it or not, but it's a good looking bag, isn't it? So let's see. But it does have the strap in it for a crossbody. And the condition on the inside looks good and clean. It's a good buy for somebody. The sack. Let's see what this is. Nicole Lee. This baby blue. Well, it's good condition. Here's the brand on this baby blue one. Can't get it to shut though, but look, here's the brand. I-N-G, B-E-R, I can't tell where it's made. It's like a weenie dog on it. It's great condition, but I can't get it to stay shut. And I got it to stay shut. We're going to think about this one. I'm going to carry this around. Try to comp it at the end. See what. But it's a great condition. Vintage. Leather. And a baby blue color. Look at all this Christmas stuff. What are these glass? They're not. They are plastic. I see these. Beautiful. Christmas wine glasses and know that it's probably best I'll wait till I get to Texas because there will be lots of opportunity there to pick some things up for the Airbnb versus shipping but if there's something unusual that I think I can't live without look at this cute Santa Claus music box or not box but you know what I mean guys here these pen cushions or what is this could be pen cushions I guess left in China That's too bad he's chipped. Right there on the corner. Beautiful flower picture. And what is this little guy used for? Let's look here at the top. I don't think it's toothbrushes. $5.99. Don't 
Definitely yard decor. Wish they had more of these. Looks like a vintage pie plate and crown ovenware. Gonna look at the purses real quick now. What is this? A leopard. Is this old? It looks like patent leather. I don't know if it is or not. This one is definitely vintage. Look at this. Sharif. Sharif leopard patent leather. We are going to get that just because it's different. I don't know how much it is though. I don't know. It's just old. So we're going to get that. Maybe. There's not a price on it. So we'll have to check with them to see if they can price it. Usually they don't. If something's not priced then they won't sell it. St. John's Bay. I love when I see a St. John purse. Don't ever get St. John mixed up with St. John Bay. Looky here. Beautiful little Rosetti. There she is again. She says, I saw you give one away. I saw you give one away the other day. Can you give me away? Can you put me on your show? Please. Please, please. Tell me this is a Patrician Ash. It is. Again, we did it again. I always look for that symbol, but you can kind of tell what Patricia Nash is when you see it. So there was somebody commented on one of my videos a few days ago that they didn't know who Patricia Nash was, but looked her up when they saw the red wallet video. So that was awesome. So again, there's a second Patricia Nash during the store shopping experience. This one's in great shape as well, and it is what we say going home with CJ. So if you're new to the channel, that's what we say when we're going to take stuff home. It's going home with CJ. So again, about the time that I think I'm not going to find anything in a store, what happens? I find stuff. See, I believe it or not, I did give away a Rosetti to Tanya Kirksey. We had a drawing. Tanya Kirksey won that Rosetti. American Living. And I think she's going to frame it. And then she's going to share that picture with me after she does. She's going to frame that Rosetti. They do have some jewelry here too. Jacqueline Smith, some suede. What else we got here? This says genuine leather, crossbody, bad rubs. I don't know how that could be leather. Let's see what brand this is. It's awful bad rubs for real leather. So we found some good things in here today. I'm very happy about that. We're just gonna scan the jewelry from the count from the uh, glass because I can usually see pretty quick if there's something I want to look at or not doesn't take me but a minute and I don't see anything this trip on the jewelry we did get some good purses looking back here I don't need any furniture but the last time I was here there was a great Chinese lamp it was small, so I was just checking to see if maybe they had that steel or not, but they don't. So I'm going to show you my haul. Got this Patrician Ash with tassels, great condition, used, but still beautiful. Look at those tassels. Zoom in, let you see it up close. Great condition on the inside too. Definitely pre-loved, but still a lot of love for it to give, so we're gonna get it. This is Sharif. It looks vintage, probably a crossbody. It doesn't have a price on it, so I don't know if they'll price it for me or not. Hopefully they will. If not, so this right here is a light blue bag, and the maker, the designer is this, I've never heard this before. Ingeber, I-N-G-B-E-R. So if y'all have heard of that before, let me know. Pebbled leather, we're gonna get that one. We found another Patrician Ash when we walked in the door. 
look at it. And then we found this Kohan crossbody, so we are going to get it. It's just different looking, so I like it. And that's it. That's what we got. We got some good things. We'll see you later. Bye.